A Canadian woman named Christine Archibald was the first victim identified in the terrorist attack that left seven people dead in London Saturday night. Her family confirmed Sunday that she was among the victims struck by the van on London Bridge. Archibald was from Castlegar, British Columbia, and worked in a homeless shelter before moving to Europe to be with her fank, according to her family. In a statement released by the government, her family said Archibald would have had no understanding of the callous cruelty that caused her death. And quote we grieve the loss of our beautiful, loving daughter and sister who was 30 years old. She had room in her heart for everyone and believed strongly that every person was to be valued and respected and quote, her family said. And quote please honor her by making your community a better place. Volunteer your time and labor or donate to a homeless shelter. Tell them Chrissy sent you. And quote, Archibald died in the arms of Tyler Ferguson, her fank, his siblings told CBC News. The two were walking on the London Bridge when the van careened off the road, hitting Archibald, F-E-R-G-U-S-O-N and APO's brother Mark told the CBC. And quote, they were very madly in love and had quite the plans for the future. And quote, Mark Ferguson said. And quote, IT and APO's obviously very, very devastating for him. The love of his life has just been ripped away from him. And quote, Archibald graduated from Mount Royal University in 2015 with a diploma in social work. In a statement posted to Facebook, the school remembered her as a and quote, truly outstanding student. And quote, Emily Nussbaum, a former classmate, commented on the SCHOOL and APOS post, saying that Archibald and quote, truly was one of the sweetest and kindest girls I and APOS V ever met. And quote, 